I'm Bob Vavra, Content Manager for Plant Engineering Magazine, and on behalf of Plant Engineering, Control Engineering, and CFE Media, I want to congratulate Michael Gurney, CEO of Concept Systems, for winning this year's 2016 System Integrator of the Year Award. Congratulations, first of all. Thank you, Bob. Uh, talk a little bit about what this award means to your company and, and to your employees. Sure. Uh, you know, we take a very common sense approach to business, and for, for us, that's a customer first type attitude, and that really proliferates through our, our entire uh, business. So being recognized for doing that right is a, is a big deal for us and very much a, an honor for us. Uh, talk a little bit about your employees and, and the way you've been able to bring a, a, I would imagine, a fairly diverse group of people together to, to, to get to this kind of a common goal. Yeah, it's all about a, a common vision. And for us, that's really about uh, keeping the U.S. manufacturing industry alive and live and well so we all rally around that we really uh, obviously we're a bunch of engineers so we get a charge out of technology and all of that but making a difference with u.s manufacturing is a big deal for us give us a, your sense of the state of u.s manufacturing right now how are we doing and where's the opportunities to continue to grow well i think uh, as an industry we're doing very well you know i think there's some onshoring going on right now i think that trend is going to continue uh, i think you know, the innovation that I see on, with technology and that getting that on the industrial uh, manufacturing floor uh, is stronger than it's ever been. And I really look at robots, so the adaption of robots on the manufacturing floor. I think if you look 10 years ago, yeah, it was in automotive, but it didn't really have a strong play in a lot of other sectors. With more manufacturing or robot manufacturers <coughs> bringing that technology, dropping the price point, it's just opened up a huge market uh, for those applications. We're just now starting to learn what robots can do in manufacturing and the diversity of the ways that they're able to be used, large robots, small ones, it really doesn't matter. There's a, there's a tremendous amount of uh, robotics and I, you know, control engineering spends a lot of time talking about not just the use of robotics, but how to use them effectively across your uh, facility. Yeah, absolutely. Talk about some of the changes that Concept Systems has seen in its business over the last 10 years. Where have uh, you started and where are you at today and how has that journey been uh, along that path? What have, what have you had to do to get from where you started to where you are today? Yeah, well, it's been exactly that, a journey. So when we started off, it was just a handful of us and we were, you know, went to market saying, hey, we can do all things for all, all people. So over time, we've been asked to take on more, more and more uh, project scope, larger projects. So we've really had to evolve our total business approach, uh, looking at other services we can offer, be that mechanical services, uh, information technology services, cyber uh, security, network assessment, safety assessment. So as we've grown, we're asking and we need to take on, take on more. And, and that's an area that we've seen a lot in manufacturing where third-party companies like yours can come in and provide more than just a, a turnkey approach to a system, but you can provide service all the way along that continuum. Yeah, and we really need to be able to provide that for our customers. You know, our customers, they're experts at making what they make. They are the process experts. And to stay on top of technology that's moving so fast is a real challenge for them. So our job is to be a technology resource for them. And that's what um, is, our culture is really about through and through, just being a resource for that customer. From your perspective as CEO, what are the keys to building and sustaining a company like this, and, and where, what's the next step for Concept Systems? Well, I think the, the key is all about the vision. It starts, starts in uh, the top with our vision and what we're going, going after and staying true to that and just making sure that uh, throughout the organization people understand that, they understand the role they play in that. And again, for us, it's a very customer-centric approach. We want to be uh, a service to our customers. We need to provide that value. Well, that was one of the uh, areas that our judges responded to, and uh, congratulations once again on for Concept Systems on being named System Integrator of the Year for 2016. Thank you very much, Bob. It was a great honor.